Next up is an organ that's central to how we fuel our bodies, the stomach. This J-shaped muscular organ located in the upper abdomen acts as a temporary holding chamber for food and plays a crucial role in the initial stages of digestion. When you eat, food travels down your esophagus and enters the stomach, where it's met with a powerful combination of digestive juices, including hydrochloric acid and enzymes like pepsin. These substances work together to break down food, particularly proteins, into a semi-liquid mixture called chyme. The stomach is not just a passive bag, its muscular walls contract and churn, mixing the food with digestive secretions to ensure thorough breakdown. This mechanical action combined with the chemical digestion prepares the food for further processing in the small intestine. The stomach's acidic environment, with a pH typically between 1.5 and 3.5, is incredibly harsh, which not only aids in digestion but also helps to kill many harmful bacteria and microorganisms that may have been ingested with your food, serving as an important line of defense. The stomach also produces a thick layer of mucus to protect its own lining from being digested by these potent acids and enzymes. This delicate balance is crucial for stomach health. It also secretes intrinsic factor, a substance necessary for the absorption of vitamin B12 in the small intestine. Continuing our journey through the digestive system, we arrive at the small intestine, a remarkably long and coiled tube that, despite its name, can stretch up to 20 feet in length. This is where the vast majority of digestion and, crucially, nutrient absorption takes place. After food is partially broken down in the stomach into a semi-liquid chyme, it passes into the small intestine, which is divided into three parts, the duodenum, the jejunum, and the ileum. Each section plays a specific role in the intricate process of extracting vital nutrients from your food. The small intestine is not just a passive tube, its inner surface is lined with millions of tiny, finger-like projections called villi, and these villi themselves are covered in even smaller microvilli. This incredible structure dramatically increases the surface area available for absorption, making it incredibly efficient. It's here that carbohydrates, proteins, fats, vitamins, minerals, and water are broken down into their simplest forms and absorbed through the intestinal wall into the bloodstream, ready to be transported to cells throughout your body. Enzymes from the pancreas and the intestinal wall itself, along with bile from the liver stored in the gallbladder, are secreted into the small intestine to complete the digestive process. Bile emulsifies fats, breaking them into smaller droplets that enzymes can then act upon. Pancreatic enzymes break down carbohydrates, proteins, and fats further, 